way we are interacting with our community has certainly changed due to COVID and local chambers are getting more creative with how to connect with its neighbors. Today's community sponsor is Our Town Watsika Area Chamber of Commerce. They're celebrating 75 years and Executive Director Amanda Hibbs is joining me now. Thanks so much for being with us, Amanda. Hi, Heather. Thanks for having me today. Well, we are excited to be celebrating our town Watsika, and we know all chambers kind of do their own thing. So tell me about yours and what you're all about. Well, we've had to, as you said, think outside of the box since COVID has hit. We are trying to support our local businesses, our local chamber members, and we're trying to keep our community thriving. Um, with trying to keep people coming to Watsika to spend their dollars here. Well, yeah, and why should people come and spend their dollars in Watsika? What do you have to offer? We have a very unique community, Heather. We have a lot of mom and pa shops. We have a lot of unique shops that maybe you wouldn't find in other communities. We have a historical society. We have a historic chain depot. Um, we do have your larger franchise stores, such as Walmart, Stock and Field, Burkotts, et cetera, et cetera. But our littler shops offer our most unique um, things. We have a beautiful downtown that we like to showcase. And overall, it's just a great community. And we encourage people to come through and check us out. So why do you call Watsika home? What makes it special to you? Oh, wow. Being born and raised here, being born here at the local hospital and being raised here, um, I could just go on and on to tell you different things that Watsika has to offer. But most of all, it's the people. We're, we're a great community. We all try to come together as one. We try to work together for the greater good of our community and the surrounding areas. We are the Watsika Area Chamber of Commerce, so we try to spread that throughout our other communities as well. And you've been doing that for 75 years. How have things grown and evolved and changed over that time? Oh, wow, Heather, lots of things have changed. I would say, you know, 45 years ago, 1945 is when the chamber was established. So this makes our 75th year. Um, things back then were in black and white. We have color now. Technology is so much more <laughs> advanced. Um, social media has taken off. So there's a lot more ways that we're able to market our community than what we were 75 years ago. So to me, that's a plus. Yeah, a lot more ways to connect with your neighbors there in town. I know a lot of people are concerned, lots looking forward to Halloween. So what, what do you all have planned for that? We actually had to think outside of the box. We normally have an annual trunk or treat event that we do every year for our area children. Since COVID hit, we've kind of had to put a spin on that this year. So we are going to be doing a drive-through trunk or treat, and that will be on October 28th, starting at 6 p.m. at the Iroquois County Administrative Center. I can social distance my businesses that decorate the trunk of their vehicle. Um, children do not even have to get out of the car. Moms, dads, grandpas, grandpas, aunts and uncles can just drive the children through. My businesses that are set up are going to give them an individually packaged treat. We are going to wear gloves, we're going to wear masks, and we are going to social distance and try to make this event as fun and successful for the children as we can. Well, yeah, that's good that you're still keeping the holiday spirit of Halloween alive there in Watsika. And you know, the weather is usually hit or miss on Halloween anyway, so maybe um, a better option <laughs> than we're, trick-or-treating. We're, we're hoping. Last year it snowed here on Halloween, which was very abnormal. The snow can stay away this year. That's right, but the fun can't, and COVID can take a hike though as well. It's um, Watsika Area Chamber of Commerce, 75 years here in um, their community. And Amanda, we appreciate you being with us this afternoon. Thank you for your time today, Heather, and allowing me on the show. You are so welcome. We are celebrating our town, Watsika, and you can learn more about the chamber at our website, ciliving.tv.